Welcome back to Camping with the Confers. This week, we're taking you behind the scenes at the Ohio Grand Design Rally. It's where games are played, bones are broken, yeah, you heard that right, and friendships are made. We laughed till it hurt and made memories that will last a lifetime, and of course, got some sweet RV upgrades. So buckle up and join us for all the fun, adventure, and a little bit of chaos along the way. I wanna go somewhere far away I wanna go where they don't know my name Get out of town Cause I can't take no more In this old town It's got nothing left for me All I've got are these broken memories This new Mike here with my lovely Miss Shelly Kay. So we had a nice drive in today. Tell them where we're at. Yeah, we just barely made it. We don't, we can't have a long intro. Right. We are at the Ohio Grand Design Rally at the Evergreen RV Resort. We've been here before. We love it here. Um, and we have five minutes to make it to the main section for opening remarks. Yes, so we're gonna run over there. We'll kind of give you guys a little bit of rundown on how that goes. And then we'll show you around the campground and show you what all a Grand Design Rally has to offer. We did have a really beautiful drive in. We just are short on time now. Yeah, tons of fun. We'll show you guys uh, here in a little bit. Welcome to the 2024 Ohio Grand Design Owners Rally. <laughs> We're so happy to see all of you. The team has been working like crazy is ready for you and um, I think it's going to be the best one we've ever had yet. What do you think? I agree. I agree. Hey Michael, why don't you tell our friends what kind of crazy thing you have going on? So I've been talking some mad trash over the last few months about this downhill slalom blue boy race. I have never ridden a blue boy before. Well, I talk trash like I've been... Maybe not everyone knows what a blue boy is, so let me so back up. It's the portable poop tank. <laughs> so I just dug this thing out from our storage at our permanent site today. Sprayed it off because it had a bale of straw on it. Just so now you I'm know, trying to... That is not poo. Now I'm trying to figure out how I can steer this thing because my handle doesn't come back to me. <sighs> so I had to make a set of reins for it. But I think that'll do. Whoa, girl. Whoa. He's crazy, but he's mine. <laughs> Look at the shenanigans. Michael, don't hurt yourself, but break a leg in the best way possible. All right? All right. I need, I need a photo finish at the bottom. Look at these two crazy guys. Huh. No, no one can Wait a minute, that's a modification. Yeah. Oh, he can use that to steer. That's that's a disadvantage. Hasn't been back any further. Look at his yeah. nice big so, tires nice he has. Riding, your feet have to be on it like this, and you can push with your hands if you want to. Yes. Okay. So your feet have you to push be with your feet. Push with your feet. Yeah. Okay. And the race is on. so much so they said that you should do a two out of three do that's it again. two out of three that's two out of three no kidding. <laughs> all right so we just finished the blue boy race we came in first out of two 
Um, it was tons of fun. Just did a downhill little so slalom course. How did you pick up speed? Because like you were behind all the way, know. and then you got to that one corner. It was all those extra cheeseburgers. <laughs> In the blue boy luge. All right, so first of all, how many of you have ever seen that before? I didn't think so. All right, so because they have run in the first blue boy luge, they get the ever so coveted brown bead. <laughs> sitting here and we're talking to or we're listening to Dwayne and Belinda's story and that is exactly our story we're just three years behind them <laughs> so we've been going through the process of purging except I don't have a problem getting rid of stuff the tools let's talk about the tools <laughs> the tools are in the truck to take care of the camp that's all we need the garage is full Anyway, so we have been most hiding. We're not full-timers yet. We still own a house. We have five kids. We have five grandsons. All the kids are out for the most part, but they've been back more than once uh, to stay for extended periods of time. But our youngest daughter is still in college, so she comes home for the summertime, so Shelly Kane's not really ready to get rid of the house quite yet. We had taken an 18-day epic, you know, bucket list trip out west, you know, went to the Badlands and Yellowstone and Grand Tetons and Rocky Mountains and the whole big thing. The wall. And, uh, yeah, South Dakota. Um, anyways, and so on that trip, I was just in awe of the beauty of this country that I was like, I cannot believe I'm, I was 49 at the time, but I'm 49 and I'm just now seeing these things. So now we're about to enter, David and I are going to enter into a blue boy relay of some sort. Do you even know what this means? Nope, and I don't. we don't even know whose teams we're on. All right. We'll see. Well, good luck. The best is yet to come. Get set. Go. Go.
you see that tumble, y'all? That was real. So, so what happened? Tell us what happened. So I took turn number three a little too fast, kind of slid out on the rear end, did a couple tumbles, but we picked it back up and came in solid third place. Solid <laughs> third. Do you have injuries? No, I'm good. Minor. Uh, minor. minor. Impressively minor. Oh, okay. All right. It's a good thing you signed that waiver. Right. On your mark, get set. I don't care. You earned it. And Judy Calabanja. And Good morning, guys. So check this out. They made sausage, gravy, and biscuits for everybody for breakfast this morning. But Don made me gluten-free sausage gravy and biscuits just for me so we got that stuff warmed up we're gonna go have some breakfast you know he's in heaven guys yeah day one was tons of fun yeah the books let's see uh tons of fun except for eh. yeah he has got a, a, got a little a, stiff wrist today he hasn't told anyone about this <clears> sore <throat> wrist action yet well i got ran over yesterday which you guys have probably already seen yeah. by a blue boy so Let's see what today holds. Let's go grab some breakfast, have some coffee, say hey to everybody. And we got work to do today too. So All right. Lots of things. Hey guys, it has been a busy day. It's been a day of seminars and vendor booths and games games and food and there's still so much more to do today i mean the agenda for these rallies i mean it's like pages two pages front and back but russ and sue flowers do an amazing job putting this together so this evening we are still going to do some games and have a camper crawl with uh, a po poker run yeah, yeah. poker po poker crawl anyways pay ten dollars it goes towards the honor network Mm -hmm. um, and then you just go from site to site and you have an appetizer and a shot size cocktail. Uh, there are six hosts. We are one of the hosts. Um, we are co-hosting actually with our friends Joe and Jennifer. Mm -hmm. But Michael is making... I am making little miniature cheeseburgers on a stick for everybody. And there's 120 little cheeseburgers so I'll have to make 120 little hamburger patties and I got a long way to go and a short time to get there. And then we're gonna put them on a little toothpick with cheese and lettuce and pickled tomato. Um, so I should have told you that this is a theme. Mm -hmm. So the theme for the, excuse me, the theme for the entire rally has been the Olympics and each site host has an Olympic ring to represent. We have the red ring. Red ring. That's harder to say than what you think which um, is the symbol for America. America. So that kind of made it easy for us, but that's why we picked cheeseburgers because what is more American than cheeseburger? Right. You know what's funny though? I looked up what is uh, the American cocktail. You know what it was? I think yes, because you already told me, so oh. I'm not gonna ruin it for you. Guess, guess what it is. Put your guess down in the comments, but I'm still gonna tell you now anyways. Margarita. How is the margarita, the cocktail, the American cocktail. Right, it should be moonshine. Yeah, or yeah, bourbon or whiskey or something made with bourbon or whiskey. Right. I don't know. But no, it's the margarita. Who knew? Oh, you should go out and show them our stand that we put together for the uh, for the camper crawl. We had to decorate. They vote on the best decorated site. I'll show you real quick, but then I have got to seriously get in the shower because I'm just a sweaty mess. This is site 45 at Evergreen. We love this campground. We've been here many times. The greatest thing about this campground is they have an indoor pool and hot tub, so that's why we love to come here in the winter. But 
There's our decorated site. All right, so there's the second plate done. So that gives me 95 so far. What do we need, 120? So we're on the downhill slide. set up for our poker camper crawl and it looks like a storm is coming in. Tut tut. That's a yucky one. Michael's working on his 130 mini cheeseburgers. Who knew on a 18 inch Blackstone you could make like 75 cheeseburgers at once. <laughs> Got the cheese all cut up but I want I want to show you I lost my glasses I don't know where they're at so that's why I have to wear my sunglasses but look at this view back here. I'm gonna turn you around this way here so I can make sure I can zoom in. This is right behind our camper, this cute little farm. Got this nice big field, we can let the dogs go out here and play. Do you want a cheeseburger? Yeah. Two little cheeseburgers without a bond. One with pickle and one with uh, lettuce. One that just has lettuce, the other one doesn't. Yes, you can pick one. But the sky looks like it is going to storm. Give me some lightning. It lied. The radar lied again. All right, good morning guys. It is obviously Friday. Red Friday, a rainy red Friday. Rainy red Friday. So we went up, had some breakfast this morning. Had the hugest donut I've ever yeah, seen. Yeah, these things are monstrous. Stuck I did not have one, but, but uh, uh, I only ate half. All right, so when we were out on Vendor Alley, uh, Aero Cosmetics have this wash and wax all. This was one of the free samples that they were giving away up there. So we're going to try it on this dirty Linda right here, see how well it works, and maybe go pick some up. So we're going to do... This is just... Look at all this fingerprints and dirt and yuck all over, right? Dirt on the... So let's do... True test. We had Something other people like raving about it. And then just a microfiber cloth. I got to say, wow, I'm pretty impressed. <laughs> that works pretty good. I was like, oh, maybe you should have let it soak on there for a minute. Look at this too, right here. Oh yeah. Let's get that spot. It's gonna be like the very first time I used a magic eraser. Right? I like went around for like three hours cleaning every wall and. Something like that. That looks pretty filthy, I don't know. <laughs> I know where we're going. Wow. Gee, okay, many Christmas. Guys, this this is not this is not a sponsored anything. They're just a vendor. It's set up here at the rally and they gave everybody a sample. That's crazy. Dang. Wow, look at that. Okay. Yeah. I wonder if they sell it in gallon jugs. I think that they do. Good. 
Ooh, guys, I'm a hot, sweaty mess. We just did the show and tell tour, which was very cool. So we got to see so many different things that people have done to their rigs, get some ideas of things that we want to do to ours now and maybe our future rig. Mm -hmm. And now I'm Michael is making me a little cocktail. They're having a women only uh, seminar. It's called Pink Power. I have no idea what it's going to be about. I do know that it's being put on by Missy Cook from the Campaholics and uh, Cindy from the Honor Network. I think that's who's doing it. So. And I got put on cocktail duty with the quickness. So. Oh my gosh, this is my lifesaver. Just kind of felt like having a refreshment to take with me. Bam. For Ladies' Day. Ladies' Day. Okay, let's go Have see what fun. it's all about. All right, guys, good Saturday morning. So it's nice and early this morning, so I'm only 8.30 or so. Getting ready to head over to the pavilion and have some breakfast. After breakfast is over, we sign up for all of the games for today. I do have another, uh, I do have another race today. I have a uh, cornhole tournament today that I'm not any good at, but I'm gonna see what other kind of games they got going on over there. Shelly Kay's gonna sleep in this morning. I'm gonna go eat, so let's go. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. All right, guys. So just finished up breakfast. Had some sausage and bacon. I did make up a whole slew of pancakes for everybody. But it's 9:15. I'm gonna run back over here to the rig. Get Chili K up for the day and hook up with my more ride guy because he's going to put a new addition on the trailer for me today so stick around we'll show uh show you guys what we're getting for our next little addition to uh to the camper and then we got a bunch of games to play today too so it's going to be a fun one so a great thing about coming to rallies you know when you come to a brand specific rally like this one everybody already has something in common right because you all have the same brand of rv so we're sitting around talking to everybody and I was telling a story to some people here about how we lost our floor, our doormat that we got from Grand Design. Um, earlier this year, it was covered in mud, so I threw it in the bed of the truck and we were driving home and the wind got up underneath of it and it flew out of the truck somewhere, who knows where, who knows when. So we lost our floor mat. So our neighbors next door just come over and check this out. They come over to us and say, hey, we just happened to have a brand new extra floor mat from Grand Design. You guys are welcome to it. So just another reason to come to a uh, an RV rally. So up next, we've got our friends from Moride coming over here to the rig to install a new piece of equipment onto Olinda here. So we'll introduce you to the Moride rep and get that started. All right, guys, so today we got our representative from Moride. You wanna introduce yourself? Yeah, my name's Gary Wheeler with Moride. Uh, I've been working for the company for about 28 years now. Wow. I'll be 29 in September. And uh, what we're gonna be doing today is uh, installing one of our Moride uh, entry or safety rails. And the benefits of that safety rail, number one, you no longer have this grab handle, which is pretty wobbly, number one. The other benefit to it is you're gonna have something to hold on to from the top step all the way down to the bottom. And when you close it up, it's a, it's a real nice package. It actually blends into your framework on your door and just does a great job. Gives you a lot of security when you're walking down the steps. Center bar 
part and push in on the uh, extension. And that's all there is to it. And it's a done deal. And it's a done deal. All right, man. I appreciate you coming over and taking care of us this morning. Oh, it's my pleasure. Fred just peed on my foot down my leg. That's my boy. Chatting with people. That is disgusting. And I just took a shower. That is so gross. I have to go wash this off. I'm washing it off over here. I was just, I felt something warm. And I was like, what's going on? I got this warm feeling. Like, I, you know, because I was in the shade. And then, so I was like, oh, my foot must be in the sun now. She's, she's walking with a limp. All right, so now we're all set up for the cornhole tournament. David Warner and I got randomly drawn to play together. All right, guys, so we had the opportunity to run into another set of full-time RVers while we're out here at uh, this beautiful campground. And they are not just full-time RVers, but they are fellow YouTube content creators, well, content creators in general. Yes. Right. So this weekend, we were lucky enough to run into... Dun, da, da, da. Hi. Hey, guys. So tell everybody who you guys are. Let's tell them about your channel. Hello, Comfort. Do you all have a name for your group? Your... Well, we haven't named them, but we've had other people say Comfort Crew. Hello, Comfort Crew. Yeah, yeah. Comfort Crew. I'm Belinda. And I'm Dwayne. And we're all about the banks. From North Carolina. Yeah. Yep. We are full-timers for the past 14 months. And, um, yeah, we're just out here enjoying life. <laughs> <laughs> yep, we're enjoying traveling around and traveling across. Uh, I can't say across just yet, but traveling from state to state. And we get to meet these great people, uh, these great YouTubers and great just people in general. Mm -hmm. And uh, Mike and Shelly Kay, just, we, we, just, we just met them, met them, right, right. in person. Right. But we've known them for over a year and a half. Because yeah. so. we've yeah. been following each other's channels yeah. and mm -hmm. commenting yeah. and mm -hmm. following adventures and trials and tribulations. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. but we found that that's, uh, that has um, been the sort of the MO of travel yes. is that you meet people and either they have followed you or you begin to, to follow, follow them. And you become instant friends. Mm -hmm. I call it family. You know, friends, yeah. and fr family. <laughs> I we like become it. family. <laughs> so you know, that's that's kind of our thing. We we enjoy meeting people, and we just love meeting uh, new people. Yep. Mm -hmm. Great. Well, we're so glad that you guys came out to the Ohio Grand Design Rally, so we could finally meet in person. I know we are as well. Oh, the horse against the chicken. How are you feeling pregame? Uh, I'm feeling good. Sparky here, you know, we'll see how he does tonight. He's, he's been out to pasture for the last couple of days, so. He looks a little angry. He's got a thing against sumo wrestlers, so. Girl power, representing the women here. Got it. I have faith in you. I've made a couple contingency plans. Maybe somebody will love All right, it's game time. Let the games begin. Hey, you can always trip Woo! somebody if you have to. I was going to bring a hockey stick. Let's, let's get the contestants for the great inflatable race. In On your mark. Don't run over me, please. Get set. Chicken with a hurt butt cheek. <laughs> Chicken with its head cut off. <laughs> All right, man. So that's a wrap, guys. Grand Design Rally. In Ohio the version. The Ohio in the book. So thanks to Russ and Sue Flowers for keeping us all wrangled the best they can and keeping uh, keeping everything going. And all of the volunteers and right. the impact team, etc. Yeah, and for Grand Design too, you know, they were out here, you know, fixing stuff, more ride, fix some stuff or put some new stuff on for us. You know, just get out there. It doesn't matter which brand you have, find a rally, get to it. And you'd be amazed the people you meet, the stuff you can get done, and the money you'll save because they usually give discounts 
for like special rally pricing. Yeah, and like uh, Belinda Banks from All About the Banks said, she said, we're really framly here. And <laughs> I like I mean, that, framly. It is true, like I'm sad to be leaving. I don't know when I'll see these people again, but when I do, I know that we will pick up, like time has not passed. Yep. It was definitely a good time. Yeah, so we gotta get on the road, get back to our full-time spot and uh, continue on with the camping adventures. So if you like this stuff, make sure you guys hit that like button. Please hit the subscribe button. It is absolutely free and- And keep your adventures going guys. 100%, see you guys.